This is Stephanie Kirst, Electromagnetic Radiation Specialist and Building Biologist, and today I'm going to show you how to use a Safe and Sound Pro 2 RF meter. So we are going to go ahead and turn it on. I'm going to leave the volume off so that you can hear me on the video, but what I want you to notice is that my arm is fully extended in front of my body, and then the correct way to take the measurement is to turn your wrist in a figure eight holding your arm out in front of you, and ideally to turn your wrist at the same time. You want to measure in a figure eight method like this, because that way you're capturing the waves that come in on the X, the Y, and the Z axis. So you're getting a complete measurement. For source detection, if you find what you think is a source of RF, you can slowly walk closer toward it and look at the numbers on the peak, the top number there. That measurement is what is being read at that particular moment in time. It will always constantly fluctuate. So if you feel like it really jumps around a lot, simply write down the range of numbers that you're seeing. The max reading is simply the highest reading that the meter has recorded since we turned it on for this measurement period. The average reading um, doesn't do much to serve our purposes, so you can ignore it. I hope this is helpful. Thank you.